Sunday, the 3rd of November, 2024. First reading. Reading from the book of Deuteronomy. Moses said to the people, If you fear the Lord your God all the days of your life, and if you keep all his laws and commandments which I lay on you, you will have a long life, you and your son and your grandson. Listen then, Israel, keep and observe what will make you prosper and give you great increase, as the Lord the God of your fathers has promised you, giving you a land where milk and honey flow. Listen, Israel, the Lord our God is the one Lord. You shall love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, with all your strength. Let these words I urge on you today be written on your heart. Responsorial Psalm I love you, Lord, my strength. I love you, Lord, my strength, my rock, my fortress, my savior. My God is the rock where I take refuge, my shield, my mighty help, my stronghold. The Lord is worthy of all praise. When I call, I am saved from my foes. I love you, Lord, my strength. Long life to the Lord, my rock. Praise be the God who saves me. He has given great victories to his king and shown his love for his anointed. I love you, Lord, my strength. Second reading. Reading from the book of Hebrews. There used to be a great number of priests under the former covenant, because death put an end to each one of them. But this one, because he remains forever, can never lose his priesthood. It follows, then, that his power to save is utterly certain, since he is living forever to intercede for all who come to God through him. To suit us, the ideal high priest would have to be holy, innocent, and uncontaminated, beyond the influence of sinners, and raised up above the heavens, one who would not need to offer sacrifices every day, as the other high priests do for their own sins and then for those of the people, because he has done this once and for all by offering himself. The law appoints high priests who are men subject to weakness, but the promise on oath, which came after the law, appointed the Son who is made perfect forever. Gospel Acclamation Alleluia! Alleluia! Your words are spirit, Lord, and they are life. You have the message of eternal life. Alleluia! Gospel Reading from the book of Mark One of the scribes came up to Jesus and put a question to him, which is the first of all the commandments. Jesus replied, This is the first. Listen, Israel, the Lord our God is the one Lord. And you must love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, with all your mind, and with all your strength. The second is this, you must love your neighbor as yourself. There is no commandment greater than these. The scribe said to him, Well spoken, Master, what you have said is true, that he is one and there is no other. To love him with all your heart, with all your understanding and strength, and to love your neighbor as yourself. This is far more important than any holocaust or sacrifice. Jesus, seeing how wisely he had spoken, said, You are not far from the kingdom of God. And after that no one dared to question him any more. Gospel of the Lord